we're back. It's level four, pal. Yeah. This is exciting, right? This became my favorite thing uh, in season three, where you and I just uh, shoot the shit yeah. over some the weird happenings. Uh, David Hasselhoff is in our topics and tangent news. Uh, I, and you know, no, no year is really complete without a Hasselhoff story. It's true. Uh, Hoff. Yeah. Bet you think this is my real hair. But by the way, that's the worst pickup line ever. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Bet you think this is my real hair. Never works. <laughs> Uh, never works. Oh, why? It, it's, why it doesn't? <laughs> uh, David Hasselhoff is auctioning off the kit car uh, from Knight Rider. It's funny that if you're a celebrity, it's called an auction. If you're a nobody, it's a yard sale. So <laughs> you guys put that together. And and this isn't even the best part of the story. Uh, he's, he's <laughs> I, I like that this is, I'm reading this. The, the actor is also auctioning off a wide range of, <clears throat> quote, official, Merchandise. <laughs> Hoff official yeah, merchandise, see. including a Baywatch pinball machine and a 14 foot model of Hasselhoff's body that's the real that one. was used in the SpongeBob SquarePants I, movie. Yeah, that's, um, that's, that's the real, out of all of that, that's what I think is worth. You know, some freak is going to get that <laughs> and just be like, what are you doing? I'm mounting a 14 foot Hoff tonight. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got me a tub of Crisco at the Costco market, and I'm greasing up that ch muscly chest. <laughs> We're gonna see what's under them britches. Yeah, under those red Baywatch shirts. Uh, what else do we have? Um, Lizzie Borden's house. Let's go completely different. Uh, the first original uh, psycho murderer, uh, Lizzie Borden, house is the site of the August 4th, 1892 hatchet murders of Andrew and Abby Borden, Lizzie's parents. Apparently they didn't, uh, Get to the 911 quick enough. Get me 911 642. Now it's it's it went on the market and it's it's what is it for? It's like two million dollars. Yeah. Who I don't know who's buying that kind of thing. Richard McGonagall. Mm. <laughs> That's a great call. Richard's probably like I put it a bid. <laughs> I, I've just always been a fan. I just, I'm going to use it as the murder south cottage. I'm up in Maine. <laughs> I don't know. She was a long lost niece. I bought her that hatchet. I am 200 years old. Okay. I don't Dude. even know what we're doing anymore, but that's topics and tangents. We're about to play a game that's going to make you crazy. What are we playing? Left for Dead 2 on the Xbox. So I'm going to have to. New controller. You New learn. controller. Yeah. Great. Mm. This is going to be fun. How do I pick up stuff? Uh, Talk to me. <laughs> I forget now. It's, it's uh, like second nature. Oh my God, I'm alone. Oh, I'm screwed. I got to get the hell out of here. What is that? I want that. I think that's ammo. I need to get running. So are these actual people I'm playing with? Yeah. So they're like, that guy sucks. Pretty much. So oh, so I'm, why did you not just put me in, why am I, I'm, now I'm embarrassed. Why? Because I'm playing it, it, with I people that. I think this that, has to be, this is, a, it's like a multiplayer game. It has to be, I, or, or co-op, I think. Um, oh, for God's sakes. This is just awful. Oh, you are just getting, it is not a good day for you. Oh, you don't have a healing kit. Oh, look, I think I did it. We're safe for now. Wow, dude. Okay. Not bad. That works. Oh, nice, dude. That guy is, see, you have, they're friendly people. These are good people. They're like, hey. Like, they understand the need for teammate. Oh, yeah, axe, axe. Oh, that guy was chopped in half. Yeah, well, that's how I roll. But I'm going to tell you what's. Uh, yep, how's you your face? You have no arm. Yeah, take that, Shed. Run. Uh, he's going to throw. Oh, that guy just threw uh, a giant mound of dirt and no pistol is not going to cut it in this situation everybody is uh wow that was quick yeah mm. uh if you want to kick uh someone out you could vote to kick them out right on the d-pad is yes left is uh, uh what is left you kicked the guy out they didn't kick me out i know <laughs> Oh, now it's time to just start swinging shit. Weapons, where are you? Oh. This is not going well. Oh, it's like the whole horde decided to be like, you know what, that Nolan guy? Get him. Uh, that's probably all it is. Ah, we're safe for now. 
Ladies and gentlemen, it's Jack Quay. What's up? Oh, Hello. Big, big round of applause. How are you, pal? I'm doing good, man. Thank you so much for having me on the show. Are you kidding me? This is, uh, you are a very special guest because you are the first guest oh. of the new season. Today, uh, you're going to tell us all about uh, season three because um, this is what we're doing. So uh, where do you want to start? Uh, I, I, I mean, I don't know. I can't really say too much because they, uh, no, no, you can just, no, this is, not really. no, this is, no, no, uh, we're taping this. We'll air it after, uh, you, the, the stuff that you tell us airs like, like, like a uh, Carl Urban's, uh, I hear he loses a foot in like episode That's two. Not, I mean, I, I haven't, I can neither confirm nor deny. He said uh, it. Okay. So that, so that. that is a possibility. Cause I heard that. We're just, I'm just, wanna, I just want to put this out there just so I'm not in like, I don't know, in breach of anything or whatever. Like I, I can neither say that that does happen or that doesn't happen on right. the show. Mm -hmm. You know, everything's just really under wraps. You know, I can't really give out any details. So, 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 so you say it's under wraps. So you're saying it's like the next superhero is the mummy. Some type of a mummy not, Egyptian no, warlord princess with a with a lightsaber. Mark Hamill is in it. Mark Hamill in I season can, three, confirmed by Jack. I, That's awesome. I, I call Mark. I love Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill. Yeah, have you gotten not to work with him? I can tell you this. I can tell you this because it's been announced. Um, Jensen Knuckles is in the show. I know. I read for that part. He's playing. <laughs> <laughs> You think I'm kidding? You know, my my role upcoming. Um, should we? I, I do you want to tell them? I mean, I I did finally get a role in the boys. I'm a uh, in my superhero, and <laughs> can neither confirm or deny. I mean, I'm denying. I, I don't think I, I haven't seen it in the the scripts or anything yet. Look, here's but, the deal. Uh, I, I found I found some email addresses of the producers. I want to pitch them. Me you coming found on the show. Some email addresses? Yeah, I got. It. Don't worry about it. Sure. So I'm dropping your name, by the way. I hope you're cool with that. And tell Carl no. I dropped his name as well. Um, I'm, I'm sure I'm he won't be cool to, with it. I'm going to be a superhero. What? Uh, but I need to pitch him. What? What? We're trying to come up with an idea of like what superhero power would I would I would I promote? Let's let's spitball, Drew. You can be part of this. Tell me what kind of hero um, power? What could I? I mean, let's. You know what? What you know? We, we call him Cancel Man because I think my involvement in season three <laughs> could assure that there would be no season four pickup. <laughs> I'm, cancel. I'm in as long as we pronounce it Cancelman. Cancel. Yes. Hello, I'm Simon Cancelman. <laughs> there you go. And uh, come browse my showroom. Look at all these gorgeous leather coats. <laughs> Why did we? Boy season three, why did they cut to that guy? I don't know. Why did they keep cutting to Simon Cancelman? He has nothing to do with the rest of the show. Yeah. Action. Uh, hi, I'm Simon Cancelman. Come browse the showroom. We have all kinds of leather coats, black, yellow, and brown coats, belts too. You should come by and pick some up. See. The beautiful merchandise we have, only at Cancelman's Leather Coats. Come, I am slash, slash, slashing prices. That's awesome. Uh, we can't thank you enough for the people who do support this show. Yes. The show wouldn't happen without that support, honestly. Uh, That's right. You know, for the things we have to, cameras, equipment, lights, editors, stuff like that. So it's 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 so awesome that we're able to do this, and we hope that you know we bring you the content that uh, you want to support. And That's right. And if you're not a subscriber and you're new to this channel right now, you have no idea who that was. That's Drew. <laughs> That's Drew. That's the voice that sits over to the right. He's he's Drusephine J. Drusef, and and oh my, he just he just just he spits venom. As Eminem would say, <laughs> he spits venom. He spits what? knowledge, that's, and you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna that's... take it in. He's from Kentucky, yeah. so yeah. if you wanna send soap, you can do that too. <laughs> Join Retro Replay. <laughs>